everyone, Kibi King 77 here from acsyndicate.net here to do a quick video for you guys with my Samsung Galaxy S3 here to do a video showing you how to change the lock screen shortcuts on your lock screen. So of course you've got your awesome uh, lock screen on your Galaxy S3 with your ripple effect. You swipe anywhere and you can unlock it. You can also press and hold on one of these applications and swipe away from it and it takes you to that application. So you have those lock screen shortcuts. but it did take me a bit of time to figure out how to change those shortcuts. You can't just press and hold on an icon or anything like that. That won't work. Um, it took me a little while, so I figured uh, a lot of you guys are going to run into the issue as well. So I figured I might as well do a video. So what we're going to need to do is go ahead and go into settings. So press that settings button. And once you're in settings, go ahead and scroll down until you find security. So go ahead and navigate to security. And once under security, you'll see lock screen options right there. Uh, you will see shortcuts. Uh, you can turn them off if you don't want them. And of course you turn them off and right away they're gone. You'll see they're not at the bottom anymore. Or you can turn them, you can turn them on and you can also uh, tap on the shortcuts button and it will take you directly into them. And of course you gotta find out which one you wanna change. So you can go ahead and change one of them. Let's say I wanted to have Gmail as one of them. There you go, it changes. So all you have to do is tap on the icon, brings up a list, a list of all of your applications. Uh, obviously you can choose whichever one you want, whether it be navigation, browser, clock, Google Talk, all that good stuff. So I mean, it really doesn't matter. So once I set that uh, Gmail shortcut there, it should pop up right away, and it did. So you'll see, uh, I replaced it with that uh, Gmail application, and that would be it. So that's how you change those shortcuts. Took me a little bit of time to find it, but again, I did find it. You have a lot of other um, different little cool features, such as camera quick access. I haven't tried it yet. It says holding the device straight, tap and hold the screen, and rotate the device to open the camera. So I can try and turn it on. Um, um, let's go ahead and turn that on and then I will go into here and I believe if we rotate it it turns on the camera and it did so there you have it so there's a camera quick access if you uh, want to use a, if you like having a camera shortcut on your home on your uh, lock screen you can turn on that camera quick access and when you are in your lock screen go ahead and just tap on the lock screen and tilt it like you're about to take a picture and it opens up the camera so there's a little nice uh, little quick feature there for you guys but there you have it that's how you change your lock screen uh, shortcuts on your Samsung Galaxy S3. Hopefully this helped you guys out. Uh, be sure to subscribe to me. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. All links will be in the description of the video below. Um, but other than that, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, and thanks for watching.